What's going on, guys? Gemini Berserker here, and welcome today to some Dark Souls 3. Now, it's been very anticipated, just came out not too long ago, and I actually meant to get it. Well, I actually did get it like a week ago, and, and I recorded and everything, and all this other stuff, and meant to upload it. But anyhow, I want you guys to sit back, relax, and get your snacks. So, this is this is gonna be a trip, man. I'm cool. Dang. Okay, guys, so we're starting our adventure off in the world of Dark Souls 3. And previously, I have played um, Dark Souls 2. Never recorded it, though, because I'm, like, nowhere in there. I mean, if you would like to see me play it, uh, I guess leave a comment or something below. Let me know if you guys want to see it after. I don't know, I don't know if it'll be after this adventure, because knowing Dark Souls is going to be a long-ass adventure. Not as long as uh, Bloodborne though. I did play Bloodborne, beat it without a, not gonna say without a problem, but beat it fairly, fairly quick. I guess within the me, me the span of me playing it, I I beat it within about like uh, I think the first time I beat it was around 48 hours, a little earlier than that. So uh, anyhow, uh, we're just gonna get into this. Fuck those two guys. Oh! Who the fuck is shooting at me? Fuck you. Alright. Don't you swing on me, bitch. Swing on me. Shoot at me. You guys know what I meant. And Can I live in those mountains? Like, I, I want to go live in those mountains with the monks and shit. And what the... Oh, yeah. So, my man is, is blind and... Well, he's not blind in one eye. He's One eye is pure and the other eye is dark. Because, you know, my man's got the Gemini Berserker throw my little shit in there but um yeah you know i had to get the orange juice real quick but anyhow yeah so i I'm, i plan on doing a series for this because you know why not man it's, it's a new game it's, it's fun i like it i like it so far i mean i like dark souls too it's just fuck <laughs> those guys are dicks as fuck of and give me that shit now i uh I don't know, this game is it's really fun, it's fun to play. It's very beautiful, like the graphics are clean as shit. Where the fuck do you come from? No! Don't sneak in my booty, no. You don't do that. <laughs> but anyhow, yeah, so I hope you guys no, I want this to be Ow, you bitch, I was not blocking. So Cosmic actually he has this too. He's doing his own thing for this. And uh I'm actually still figuring out button commands. So that's triangle. Um, all right, but anyhow, so I I forgot in this game that blocking is your best friend because I got so used to playing Bloodborne and because there's no blocking mechanic in that game, so your rolls have to be on point. Because if your rolls are not on point, you will get fucked in that game terribly. Not I mean not worse than this, but pretty bad. So. It's, a, it's all a timing game, and the parrying in that game is weird, too, but, I mean, I would say a lot better than this, but I don't, I can't parry to save my life, and fuck you, you're dead, but, and, ooh, you bitch, ooh, motherfucker, uh, but anyhow, yeah, I'm really bad at parrying, so you might not see me, you might not see me parry at all in this gameplay, I might get lucky and hit one swing on a boss or a random enemy and ooh I'm gonna take this sword. Ooh. My man's got shot through the heart with this shit and I'm gonna put that in my pocket. But oh hey um I don't I don't know what to do. Oh he looks 
I don't know. He looks angry, but fuck him. He's gonna go in. Oh! Oh! No. Oh my god! I fucking pull a sword out from you. Ow! You do me like this. How could you? Monster. Okay, dodge that. Dodge that. Alright, gonna swing on the ankles. Who? Motherfucker. No! Damn it! Oh my god, I really don't want to die on this first boss. I'm gonna just run. Oh my god, he almost hit me. I had to take a sip. Oh motherfucker, no. Alright, like I said before, like you see how your rules gotta be on point. He, he missed. But your rules gotta be on point for this game because if you're not used to. Wow, what the fuck is coming out of this man's body? Fuck it, but we're just gonna keep playing. But oh, shit. Come on, roll, roll, roll. Okay, got it. Now, like I said before. Uh, like I said before, your rules gotta be on point, and... Come on, can I kill him? Yes! Fuck you, guy! You can eat a dick! It teaches you to do... Cheat... Fuck, that shows you how to not mess with people. You scum. So, anyhow... I wanna... I wanna do more of this, but... It, I mean, it, it seems like you guys really like the, uh... The Adventures of Tiffany. A lot, cause it's getting a lot of love. Um, so I guess if if that's getting a lot of love, this will definitely probably get some love. So I I want you guys to enjoy this. Actually, this isn't more so about me playing games. It's about me going on an adventure with you guys joining me. Who was that? Either way, this man. Fuck me, man. But yeah, so it's more about an adventure. Because I, I want you guys to enjoy... Oh, see, 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 blocking's your best friend. But I want you guys to actually enjoy this. I don't want you guys to actually just... I don't don't look at him and be like, Oh my god, this guy's so bad. It's like, I'm not that bad. I mean, yeah, I'm bad, but I'm not that bad. There's a lot worse people out there. There's always... Just remember, there's always going to be someone better and someone worse than you. Like my... Like fucking Breeze... Whenever we play uh, fucking Naruto or something together, fuck that guy. We're, whenever, who the fuck in their right mind? Look, motherfucker, I'm trying to do my thing here, and you gonna fuck that up? No. But, <clears throat> like I said, whenever me and Breeze or Cosmic play Naruto, they always get mad because... It's a quick story, <laughs> real quick. Um, a while back, like when the game first came out, well... Me and, me and fucking Cosmic went to the midnight release. It wasn't that many people, because, you know, it's a Naruto game. Not many people are excited about it. Unless you're a loser. It's like, no! No, we are not doing this. No. 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 Fucking dogs. Why would they put that in here? Like, that is just evil. Fucking dogs from Bloodborne got me shaken up and shit. But whenever we play Naruto, they kind of... Breeze calls me a god in that game, and I'm like, alright, but, yeah, I'm better than you, but I'm also, I'm also a lot worse than a lot of other people out there. Like, cause I, I know it doesn't seem like I put up my losses, even though I, it's like, you know, and I swear to God, honest guys, like, I try and look for my losses, like, when I do have some, because I like to show that I can lose, and that I do lose. Because if I just put up videos of me winning all the time, it gets like boring, and I know you guys hate that. I know people, because I, I don't like winning all the time. I don't like winning. Winning isn't fun without losing somewhat, because then you learn humility. And without humility, you know, you just go through life thinking you're the top shit, and you're not. So, you never want to have that mindset when it comes to doing something. This guy is just super depressing. Fuck him, I'm just talking here. But, yeah, so, you never want to, I mean, if you, because I've come across people who, they haven't beaten my shit in, but they gave me a really good fight, and I lost, and I was like, okay, and whenever I get a good loss, I'm, I always tell them, hey, you did a good good job, not not trying to sound sarcastic or nothing, like, good fight, man, good shit, because I have met a lot of people who, like, I, I mean, like, they'll put in their mic, and I'm like, oh yeah, you're really good and shit. And like, even though, even if I lost, you're like, yeah, you're really good, man. Let's let's have another fight. And oh, so yeah, bonus thing. I forgot about this thing walking through, and I missed it. So I'm gonna kill this ice iguana, whatever the fuck it is, and just murder it. You know? 
So, but yeah. So I uh, shit. What do you call it? Um. So yeah, a lot of a lot of stuff happens with that. And recently, your boy just topped the DLC. You know, I'm really excited about that. I got all the uh, ultimates and no. All the ultimates and shit now. Well, most of them are the new ones now. And I'm really anticipating to use them on some people online because I really like them, especially my nigga Lee and Guy. No, what the? No. The fuck was that? Ain't that about a bitch? Oh my god. Alright, attempt two on that ass. And get my souls. Alright, so like I was saying, motherfucker, don't interrupt me. So like I was saying before, oh my god. Like I was saying before, for this rude ass ice iguana interrupted me. I God, what the fuck was I saying? This motherfucker stop me from talking and shit. Well fuck him. Ice ass iguana and shit reminds me of fucking Fuck. Well oh, the Naruto. So we and Guy finally get a combo even though they should have had one. Like, since they started doing the Team Ultimates, which was in Revolution, and I was kind of disappointed that Lee and Guy didn't get one, and for the fact they made it DLC, kind of made it worse on my behalf, because that, that kind of made it worse on my behalf, because I was like, ah, oh, that's... Motherfucker. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? I beat the fucking first boss without any problem, and now this Icy Guana is giving me the hardest time in the world, so fuck him. And I'm just upset. I tell you guys a, a depressing, okay story, and I want to provide some excellent, uh, some excellent gameplay. Well, not excellent, but subpar okay gameplay with some subpar good commentary. But you know, it's all. I'm I'm about ready to quit on this motherfucker. I ain't quit. I have never quit in an RPG like game like this. But I, well, no, let me not say that. I quit on Dark Souls too. Like, very beginning. Very beginning. I fuck. <laughs> Motherfucker. Ah. Ah, all right. Attempt number seven hundred eighty-two. No. Not really. It didn't take me that long. But either way, still took me more time than the first boss, which was upsetting. So. That I don't know if I can do But um so yeah, you know it's just a lot of different stuff is happening right now. Um I'm still gonna record some Naruto. I'm still gonna I wanna record this. Uh the adventures of Tiffany is still gonna continue. Um what else? Oh, also let me know alright, so as far as Tiffany goes, I'm not gonna be able to do the true ending for Tiffany at one point. If you guys ever wanted to see that. Now, if you do, if you do want to see the true ending, I do have another character that has all the requirements. I have all the shit to do it. It's just a matter of if you guys want to see it or not. And I know before, like one of my, I think my very first video was me and Cosmic actually doing the ending and true ending for him because he wanted to beat it because I had beat it before him. So he wanted to beat it, and I was like, alright, I'll help you. So we are going through that. Oh, that's him. So we did that, and I'll put a link in the description for that video, because, yeah, it was a good, it was, like, it was pretty good. Sounds a little shitty, but anyhow. So I want you guys to, you know, to give this a look. If you guys want to see more of this, let me know. So anyhow. Just, you know, you guys, leave a like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Because when you guys let me know how I'm doing, that makes me feel better. And it makes me give better content. So the better the content, the more views I have, the more stuff you're going to see. So good night and good luck. And I will see you guys next time on the Adventures of Guts.